Welcome back to Who Shows. As you can see here, after the last video, I got a little lazy and didn't plant them. So, today we're going to plant them. Look at those roots. So if you haven't seen my previous video, Seed the System, go back and watch it. Uh, it shows how I take the seeds from propagator through the system and get them to the stage that they're at now. Also, I'll be using my puck technique. And if you're unfamiliar with my puck technique, watch my video, A Cheap Alternative to Rock Wall and Net Cups. All right, let's have a look at these seedlings. taken up and we only had one left over and it was a sad little fella so some of the seedlings they might look a little sad now but they'll spring up really well they've just been a bit crowded for space uh, so I'll let you know how they go I'll give you some update videos and um, really keen to see how the silver beets and the broccoli go in the system. And I'm ever so slightly concerned about the tomatoes, how big their roots will get and their nutritional requirements, whether I'll have to add in a lot of potassium. I think I will. I'm hoping I don't end up with another situation like the pumpkins. Tomatoes are a fairly traditional fruit to grow in hydroponics, so I can't really see them being too much of an issue. Well, thanks for joining me today on Huchos. Like and subscribe for more. And I'll see you next time.